Steam Avatar. Okay, the Steam Avatar is of Yusuko, Yusuko from uh, the manga called Tepu. It's a manga about uh, women's MMA, uh, uh, high school women's MMA, um, uh, putting putting two conflicting worldviews about one person doing uh, doing martial arts for the love of um, uh, bettering herself. Uh, bettering herself and and just becoming stronger and better as a person, while the other uh, use uh, practices martial arts as a way to induce violence, to as a way of as a way of dealing with um, trauma, uh, as a way of dealing with abuse in in her home, like to de to de as a way to induce violence, as a way to deal with um, an abusive abusive family life. So that's what it's from. It's a really great manga. You should check it out if that's your thing. So Tepu, T E P P U. Absolutely, both are excellent in movement, but Elisa is amazing with whiff punishment. That back, f that back four is my favorite move. Oh yeah. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. I agree. Oh. I'd love to play against my army king. Well, my PSN uh, ID is uh, shortplane as well, like the same as my Twitch name, so... So you can add me on PSN if you want, and we could play a, play a few matches uh, someday. Uh-oh. Oh, that was good. Playing ranks currently promoted Elisa to Tekken King. That's awesome. Congrats. I'll maybe maybe I'll come at you with both. Uh, I'll I'll come at you with both king and armor king if anything. But honestly ranks mean uh Ranks mean nothing. I've bumped into players who are extremely toxic on ranks, for sure. I mean, ranks are isn't an obje isn't an absolute and objective way to measure your skill as a player. They've added some like Tekken prowess is one thing. Like Tekken prowess is probably the one metric that I can depend on most. Like, but it doesn't necessarily tell you how good they are, but more like how much they've played. Um. Uh, and if they have great experience, like you can get a, I can get a, a little bit of a clear idea of how much they probably know. But that's about it. If you want, like, the most objective measure of skill, like, are tournaments, in my opinion. Isn't it weird how we say tournaments, but you say, you know, we say, we say tour, but how do you, we, we don't say tur. <laughs> this fun little side note I've been thinking about. So, tournament. Tournament. quicker for me to say tournament, but, you know, it's how I always said it, but, you know, tur, tor. Ow. 
Ow. Ow. Ow! Ooh, that would've killed. There we go, Rage Rider. Tour. Tournament. That's plus one, I think, and forces crouch, by the way. Tournament is slang, as far as I know. Mm. Oh, shit. Negan with the big damage. No, I was gonna do the throw after, but I'm not that plus after forward Armor King's forward too. Well, I'm not plus to begin with. I think, I think it's neutral or minus minus one or two even. Do you think Tekken is the most balanced fighting game ever in the history of fighting games? It's among them. I mean, I, th I think it definitely is among them. Um, especially when you consider historically, I think. Um, to some extent. Tekken th like Tekken 3, 4, Tag 1, 5, and Tekken 6 have had a really wacky balance. Tag 2 is, yeah, historically Tekken isn't really that balanced of a series when you think about it, but I think it's definitely one of the most balanced fighting games, especially considering how many characters there are. So I think right now, like, I think, I think the game is in a pretty good state. I think it was in a good state when the game came out, or at least like season beginning of season two. I think the game was in its like ideal state, like most balanced state. I think ideal is difficult to say, but of course it's not perfect by any means. But I think it is very balanced because think about how Rangchu. Uh, became the best in the world with a low tier character. Like, we got Akuma who keeps getting nerfed, but he's a god tier character, and the bears are probably worse with terrible hitboxes. I was talking about bears, yeah, exactly. Um. What's I gonna say? I think the I think because the balance disparity from uh, bears to Akuma is thinner than the average fighting game, first uh, in my opinion. Damn it! I can't do that. Like Rangchu, like I don't know if that can happen now, but when when Rangchu won the Tekken World Tour Grand Finals, that was a big testament to how accessible and balanced the game was at the time. Um, but then they decided to release Leroy and Fakumram and screw everything up again. <laughs> so that was interesting. That was unreal, indeed. That'll probably never happen again, or it'll probably not happen for another 10 years or something. Hello, Rusty. Hmm. That's fine. I mean, you got you got good combo still, so you know how to do those. You just gotta get ready for the next just gotta battle. get back all the other small small nuances and movement and stuff.
before Fakum Ram and Leroy came out, uh, before or before season three, like beginning to end game Tekken Seven of season two, I think the game was in a very good state. Obviously, some characters needed work. Uh, Armor King being one of them, and he thankfully got buffed a lot in Season 3 and 4. But, like, at that point, the game was in a pretty good state. So, and that was a great time. That was a great time. And not to mention, finishing... Uh, season 2 was the golden age of Tekken 7, in my opinion. Because, considering that after... Um, Arslan Ash won Evo 2019. That was like, that was that was Tekken at its absolute peak at that point. That changed the whole world, not just Tekken. That changed not just Tekken. That changed fighting games as a whole. And hell, people thought that Kazumi wasn't even that good before Arslan came into the scene, and he was like, no, she's like the best in the game. And then, and then Leroy came out, and Evo Japan happened. 20, Evo Japan 2020 happened. Uh, which brought it all down. <laughs> but... Regardless, I've never I've never stopped enjoying Tekken. It's all it's still one of my favorite games ever. So, no matter how bad the game, bad of a state the game has been, and I always just enjoy playing Tekken. Playing against Leroy, especially, exactly. Ooh. Excellent combo. No, I should have rage hearted. I was thinking about it. I was thinking about rage harding, but I should have done it. So, how long have you guys? Uh, you guys, gals, and all, in, and everything in between. How long have y'all been uh, playing this game? <laughs> like, casually and competitively. Also, did they nerf Kazumi? Uh, because sh she's Arslan's main? Uh-oh. I was kind of ca trying to catch you in between. Um, they kind of, I mean, I don't know. She got some new stuff, and when Season 3 came along, she got some new stuff. Uh, she lost some stuff, but she all, I think, but she also got new stuff. Started in 1973. Ah, of course, that was the peak era of Tekken. Right? Ow. I've been playing Tekken from Tekken 6. Alright, cool. I love Tekken 6. I remember getting Tekken 6 for Christmas 2009. That was a great time. Hell, I enjoy playing that. Started casually playing friends in 1999. So around the Tekken 3, Tekken Tag 1 era. Learned from an actual combo in 2019, so 20 years. I'm kind of a slow learner. Hey, we all have different interests and paths. I fell in love with Tekken when they introduced this ballerina robot with chainsaws. Yeah, that was a, that was an interesting addition when that when that happened. Yeah, we all have our own way of learning, and we all have different modes of commitment to a thing. No, 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 no one less valid than the other. Um,
Oh wow, what a range! What a range! Um, we had Tekken Six introducing Lars and uh, Alisa was was a pretty big thing when that happened. Um, like first, it was an ex very unorthodox, uh, unorthodox like design overall. <laughs> nope. Oh, I can't punish that like that. All right. Yeah, <laughs> that was interesting. I just jabbed you, man. I've just played only with friends, and we and we never looked up things. But slowly, friends that stopped playing in 2019, I had to go online to find people. Found an entire new world. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, I've been pl like I've been playing Tekken since I was a kid with Tekken 3 and stuff. Um, but I never started playing like competitively, so to speak, uh, until like the end of Tekken 6, somewhere around 2011. That's when I, like, Tekken 5 was the time when I was like, Whoa, you can do combos in this game? That's cool. Uh, but then Tekken 6 came along, and uh, that's when, like, at the end of Tekken 6 was when I started playing competitively. Or like, oh, I wanna, I wanna learn how to play this game, like, well. So that's like, that's a lot of years from Tekken 3 to Tekken 6. And th if, I wonder where I would be if I started playing competitively immediately, considering there are like kids today who like immediately start playing like, you know, on they got online and playing in like tournaments, tournaments, like... Uh-oh. Oh, wow, that was cool. <laughs> I also did my first local tournament then. I was shocked to discover Kazuya's 1 1 2 is punishable on block. Mm, yeah. Hang on, gonna test out the weeb. Oh, you mean Noctis? Oh. Nice stuff. Yes, going to a tournament and seeing how people express themselves with a the character more is really cool. Armor King is probably the most purchased DLC character. I believe, I definitely believe he is. Um, I think he's... I think he's the... Like, this, the, met, the usage metrics differ, but Armor King has always been in the top five most used characters, it's like since he was released in season two. So that does not surprise. That wouldn't surprise me. I mean, I love Tekken ever, Tekken ever since I got Tekken Six, but I discovered a whole new love for the game when I picked up Kazuma. Yeah, for sure. We, we've been playing the game a lot since, like, at the end of Tekken Six. Like, we played played. Uh, with each other, especially when Tekken Tag 2 came out. So that was great. That was a great time. Thinking about firing up Tekken myself? Go ahead. I don't even remember how to play him, but I got a sudden urge to play him. Alright. Care to have a third person? Yeah, sure. Let's do it. 
Can you play on PC, yeah? There we go. I see you. I got your friend request. I'm gonna add you after this. Nope, let me go. Woo! Okay, okay, okay. Thanks for having me. Thanks for, yeah, thanks for tuning in. Great to have you. the feeling. How do I combo? Um, I don't know. Swing your swords. The small swords. Or something. Yeah, there you go. You can end with a command grab. Like, end a combo with a command grab or something? If I remember correctly. Oh shit! Add Black Five. Hey, can, can I join? Sure. Gain a whole lobby full here. Um, if you're on PC, then sure. No! I fucked it up. Yes, I am. Alright, great. Ah, strash us with the, with the combo notations here. Ooh, damn. Alright, let's set up a new lobby so we can invite some more people. Let's see here. Great session. Yeah, let's heighten it to, to the maximum. That's fine. Just in case there are more people that join in. Invite you, and I'm gonna add you to my friends list. All right, so add black. Um, you can you can add me on Steam, like if you can find this name or something like that. You can add me, and I'll add you to the thing. Because right now it's a private lobby. Like given I opened up so many slots. Um, Let's keep it to the people who are in the stream. So, anyway, Strashest, I let's see, cool little trick I discovered. If you have four people, you can do single elim tournaments. Losers only have to watch one game, but it's still tournaments, and there's and they're still buggy. So your call. And let's keep it like this uh, for now. But. All right. Uh, did you get my invite, Strashus? Welcome to the King of Iron Armor King. Nope. Okay. That's weird. Did I not send an invite? I'm pretty sure I did. Dang it! Must have forgotten. Sorry. After this match, then I promise. And then you can go, and then you can play the next match.
Alright, I got both of you on my friends list now at least. What is up with the Tekken sweat? Alright, I guess you're warm right now. Tekken is a sweaty game. At least it can be. Duck. Good break. <gasps> Excuse me. Blade hurts. Nope, that's not minus twelve. Alright, be careful now. Oh my god. <laughs> Woo! Oh, that was cool. That was cool. I jumped right into that, didn't I? Uh, you did. You for sure did. Alright, Strash is there, and Add Black is there. There we go. Have you received my invites? There's Add Black. Great. Four bars. That's great. And there you go. Alright. You guys go. Why are there so many Jaguars in here? <laughs> You're in the jungle now, son. Well, good luck. It's gonna be cool. <laughs> Get ready for the next battle. Battle, battle, battle. I have to pick up King Armor King out of spite now, huh? <laughs> I guess you do. Who would you rather play, King or Armor King? AK. Mm. I mean, these guys don't look as cool. <laughs> AK, 100%, yeah. Magnushin has expressed the same thing. Maybe you and Magnushin can become uh, sparring partners. Round one. Kazuya. Twin Pistons. Ba -ba. Ooh, unblockable! <laughs> Damn. Fight. 
Good launch. Ba -ba. Don't dare. Oh, drops. Ooh. It's good. You gotta throw the. Th you gotta get the throws out. Um, and you gotta mix up the timing of it. Good break. Ba -ba. Oh yeah. <sighs> Long range. Is it sidestep right or sidestep left against Kaz? That depends. But electric is on uh, his right hand, so. Yeah, to sidestep left. Hello, sweetheart. How you doing? How's your week going? Just having a little lobby here. Started out playing some ranked. Had some ups, had some downs. And then a lot of great people and a lot of great new people came in, came in and we started up a lobby. Look, have fun. Ooh, King versus Armor King. Here we go. Here we go. on a rainy G Corp helipad. Round one. Right, personal. I don't say GG's every time, I'm most likely thinking, but I refuse to say it cheap and said usually say the end of the session. <laughs> I mean hey, it's 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 a game. It's a video game. It's all in good fun. And it's all it's all about good sportsmanship. Some cool customizations. That black and gold from both these characters is really nice. Bow, bow. Damn, what a launch. Ah, uh, just misses the Shining Wizard. Ooh! Dang, dang. Come on, you can get- you can take- you can get this back. Hang in there, Scratch. Oh, we can launch punish that. Oh, Majin Tech? Ah, oh, I didn't quite get it. Ooh, that was a good throw attempt, but Ad Black is sharp. I would have totally expected a Shining Wizard setup right there. Good, good spacing, but what a low parry. Damn! Nice stuff. Well done to both of you. Welcome to the King of Iron, Armor King. All right, let's stick with Armor King for this one. And if it goes, 
really bad. If it goes well, we'll keep going with Armor King. If it goes really bad, well, I'm gonna have to switch over to King. Ooh. Get ready for the next this is gonna be fun. Battle, battle. Be warned. Mm. Yeah. Armor King mirrors. Uh, three bars was hard. Oh, I see. That's a shame. That's a shame. Round one. Fight. All right. Uh oh. Oh, good hop kick. Four bars for you, for me, yeah. I'm in Sweden, uh, for one, so maybe the... Oh, I thought I broke that. Um, I think that adds to it. Uh, maybe our distance isn't the same. S stands for Estonia. Okay, okay. That was a cool combo. Ow. This might be death. I think this is gonna kill. I think we should be the same distance. But maybe you got better internet. I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. Oh no! <laughs> nice. You lose. Hey, Armor King was the winner. Nice stuff. Alright, guy, you're up. At least AK1. Natless Eve, welcome. How you doing? So why you turn into a streamer? What con convinced you that this was a good idea somehow? Uh, never once did I think about that it was going to be a good idea, but <laughs> I'm kidding. Um, I don't know, I just enjoy playing games. I enjoy playing both, like, all kinds of games competitively, and um, I think it's fun to interact with a community of people. So, and I think live streaming is a new way to you know, connect with people over the interest of a game. And it doesn't just extend to playing Tekken competitively or anything like that, but just um, any game with any with any community. And um, I think mostly just it's a way to express my love of a game and being able to broadcast it for others to see and and uh, yeah, pretty much that. Here's one of my favorite quotes of all time. I know it's a bad it was a bad idea, but the lack of any good ideas I still but in the lack of any good ideas I still went ahead with it. Yeah. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> I thought it would be I thought it would be fun and uh, would be an interesting way to connect with people, so I just said, let's just do it. Ooh, good parry. And the fact that I get to, like, record, like, um, 
the things I do because I both I both like playing this uh, streaming this like this game uh, and looking back to looking back on both uh, uh, matches I played and turn tournament matches I played to like learn like rewatch my replays and that kind of thing which is a valuable re uh, way of learning and then there's um, then there's uh, It, then there's uh, when it, whenever I'm playing like single player games and stuff, um, it's it's uh, it's a way to um, it's a way to um, make a memory of the time I had playing a game. I don't always do that, and it's not for every game. Like I don't I don't enjoy streaming every game I play, but. Just having a memory of the time I had playing a game is, I, th I think, is I think is fun. So it's mostly for me that I do it. While while in turn I get to interact with a community of people, then I think that's great. Oh, good grab! Oh, barely pixel health. What a low parry! Yeah, just poke him. Oh, that's death. Ooh. I was just gonna say, hit him with a low. Hit him with a low. <laughs> Good stuff. GG's. Alright, we're up. I don't even know what half of these grabs are. <laughs> the last one you got hit by was a tombstone, which is a two. Um... I don't remember what other grabs there were. That's half more than most. Mm. Headbutts are two. Mm. Giant swing is one. Get yeah. Ready for the next battle. Battle, battle. The rest are one plus two. Unless you're doing, unless you're doing um, uh, chain grabs, obviously. Shining wizard, but I never get the break. Yeah, that's a one plus two. Mew, how you doing, Nathless Eve? Ooh. Fresh. Round one. Fight. Good block. Nope. Hmm. Damn. Okay. Round two. Your king's husband? Hey, that's, that's nice. I mean, let's be honest, who wouldn't want to marry King, huh? He's a, g he's a good, strong, morally sound man. Hmm. He just doesn't know it yet. Ah. Ooh, damn! Shadow step one counter hit setup. That's cool. No! That missed? <laughs> nice hop kick. Bah, bah. No, nice sneak. A nice up forward three. Fight. 
I didn't tech that. Woo! No! Oh, nice. Good stuff. I panicked. <laughs> nice. But it worked exactly. You just gotta do what works. Hmm, what's gonna be for dinner today? thinking spaghetti. I can do one more game, then I have to start with some food. Alright, yeah. Our minds were on the same plane. I think I'm definitely back in, um, in, uh, I'm really enjoying my time with this game. Alright, we gotta run back. Let me try King next time, next match. What is that region or country right there, uh, on the, on the Adablack? Ooh, neat customizations. What's that even? South America? Okay, okay. Saudi Arabia. Oh. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, no. The South America South America does not look like that. My geography got mi mixed up there. <laughs> my geography skills. But yeah, Saudi Arabia, okay. Ooh, good duck. Ooh. Damn, what a setup. You win. This time the connection felt way better. That's great. That's great. Alright, let's go, guy. You got this. What it did to me didn't feel better. <laughs> well done, though. Yeah. For sure. Hmm. I had no idea Saudi Arabia was going to have this this good of a connection. Like, for, for me, at least. So I've played against... The, the, that means I've played against plen plenty of other Saudi Arabian... Uh, play years before, in both uh, in ranked and stuff. So, hmm. Strash humor. I have sent. Sorry, man. And I like an uphill battle, so don't you dare ease up. Yeah, I agree. No pain, no I completely agree. Me neither, it feels good. Round one. Fight. The logo is technically the Middle East. It is, yeah. I mean, Turkey is, in, is uh, on it too. Alright. Fight. 
so it's so mixed up with Paul this time. Ooh, the range on that. If by any chance he is from Turkey, then... <laughs> or something like that. He just wants to bully with Paul. Is that what you mean? He isn't from Turkey. Alright, that's that's sixty percent gone, or fifty-five at least. Hit him. Do the full run setups or full run uh, plus frames. Wapa! Whiffed harder than I do in game. <laughs> do the running too. Do the running too. Get those plus frames in. Plus frames and grabs. Ooh, nice launch. There you go. Bah. Ooh, he grabbed. <laughs> Alright. Bop, bop, bop. It's gonna be dead even. Alright, here we go. <gasps> ah, there you go. I did rage shard, but it didn't come out. Hmm. That's a shame. I thought I imagined it before, but nope, you actually say, Opa! When someone makes a big strike, I thought it was a Russians thing. I mean, I say it sometimes. So scared to press any buttons against Paul? Welcome. I mean... All right, let me go with King this time. King. I mean, Paul isn't necessarily like the fastest character in the game. He's got he's got a lot of threat, especially with rage. Um, but hey, a mindset you can have is to like not let him get in on you. Just use use your use your pressure and setups to like never let him um, get the. Get the high ground on you. He hurts, yeah. But if you do, if you don't let him get those get that stuff in, he's not gonna hurt. It's not gonna hurt. So you'd like so you just hit him back. Round one. Just need to play more. That's the thing. I gotcha. Woo! Damn. I would have avoided it if I kept ducking. Ooh. Wanted to do RC combos and shit. <laughs> Roman cancels. The beatings will continue until moral improves. Yeah. Just gotta mix. Just gotta change up the mindset. Oh, that was a one. Nah. Oh, it didn't kill. But that was death anyway. And the more you play, like the more confident you get in your skill and stuff and what you can do. Yeah. Ah, okay. Yeah, I'm using the the other king is Empress. Yeah, there's two. There, I have two mods: the Tekken Four announcer mod and uh, 
um, and the uh, feminine term for uh, for rank for ranks like te Tekken God becomes Tekken Goddess, Emperor becomes Empress, that type of thing. Because there is a bit too much testosterone in Tekken. Let's be honest. Oh, good stuff. Gotta recognize... Gotta recognize the... The women of power in this game, too. You know what I'm saying? Ow! Gonna make some food? Alright. Um, thank you very much for watching, Bionis Gang. Good games. Hope we can play some more Tekken soon. No! Oh, that's a two! Ah! <laughs> Too much testosterone. We can have a waifu battle next. <laughs> hey, I'm down to I'm down to do um, Elisa. Want to do that? Yeah. Bring your Elisa then. Let's do it. Let's do it. Good stuff, Ad Black. Very good stuff. Very even. That match. <sighs> okay. Devil's Pit, huh? Ow. Shoutouts to Cuddlecore, by the way. And congrats to Cuddlecore for getting the Red Bull sponsorship. Katarina. Man. I need to fight against Katarina more in general. Fight. Ah, Snake Edge. Bah. Oh, damn it, I didn't block. Nice. Whoop, I did not mean to do that. Sorry. traps here today. Good duck. Round four. Fight. Woo! Oh. 
Nope. Let go of me. Ooh. Ow. Ooh, nice. At least that's cool. Nice stuff. All right, back, back to King again. Hmm. Welcome to the King of Hope everyone is having a good day. Fine Wednesday evening. It's currently 6:09 p.m. here in Sweden, and we've been at it for an hour and 51 minutes so far. It's been great to play with you guys and to hang out. And th thank you for watching. Thank you for hanging out. It's been great. And some really great matches today as well. Hachi, huh? Likewise, thank you for streaming and the matches. Thank you. Thank you all very much for the follows as well. Can't leave that out. Ah, didn't block it again. Plus one, so I wouldn't have beat that anyway. Damn it. I'm dead! <laughs> nice. Oh, I gotta go to the bathroom. Nope, can't do that. There we go. Okay, okay. <laughs> what, like, why couldn't I while standing four punish that? That was... Oh, man.
Oh shit. Mm -mm. Mm. What is the frame data of that the second hit? Or the second hell sweep? I'm completely oblivious to that right now. No, that doesn't work. No, nice. Nice axe kick. Gotta say, love the drawings of King you've done. Uh, which ones? Um, are you talking about the stuff that's below there? Because um, that I didn't do any of that. Second hell sweep is minus not A to minus nine. Okay, okay, I got gotcha. Bonus feedback. Went reading your went reading your about. It seems like you wanted to make the train tracks picture a link. If so, it doesn't work. Ah, uh, I didn't want to make that a link. Um. um it's just there for show. Uh, so sorry about the confusion. Get ready for the next I'm not even exactly sure what I've written right there right now. Let me check it out. Let me check it out. But yeah, I do have I do have a Instagram and portfolio page. Um, um, there's there's my art station, which you can find, um, and then there's my Instagram, Instagram.com/slash Shoreplane. Um, all the same name everywhere. Um, I should definitely up update that. Alright, King and Armor King again. Bop, bop. You got this, Strash. You can do it. No need to be sorry. Sorry is meant to be said if you didn't do... If you... If you've done something wrong and you regret it. If, mm. Yeah, but... For the inconvenience. It's just what I do. Ooh, whoa, okay. I forget that launches. Almost. <gasps> ba ba. Ooh, good punish. Good knowledge. Nice stuff. Good launch. Ooh, the pressure is on. Good break on the tombstone. Whoa, 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 whoa. This should be death. Yeah. And we're even in rounds. Good stuff. We got 10 whole viewers in here right now. That's That's huge. Hope you all are having a fine Wednesday evening, or morning, or night, depending on where you're watching from. So I'm in Sweden right now. Oh my god, double jab into Shining. That was sick. That was an amazing combo. You win. Great stuff, Ad Black. GG's. Oh, you gotta go. Alright, good games. Great to have you. Good Just passively watching and playing HK. Oh, Hollow Knight. Thank you very much for the follow, Ad Black, and thanks for the games. Thanks for hanging out. Alright, here we go. I'm gonna go back to Armor King for this one. And we're about to hit the two hour mark. Welcome to the King Do as you please. Alright.
I'm going to do Armor King for this one, and for the next one, I'm going to jump over to King, I think. I think that's how I'm going to do it. I think I'll go on for another 12 minutes until it hits um, 6.30, and then I'm probably going to call it to make some dinner. That sounds great. And uh, for those curious, I will, I think I'll be, I usually upload this kind of stuff to my YouTube channel. So if you want, so if you want to see this in replay, you can, well, both check it out on my Twitch uh, video archive, but, uh, but you can also find it on my YouTube channel. It's a clean customization with the purple. How is Hollow Knight treating you right now? Uh, Edus. Woo! Whoa! How did he know? <laughs> that was cool. No, that's a mid, of course. Can't duck that. No, it's not that punishable. There we go. It's great, just exploring all the corners here and there. Found some surprise boss along the way. Can't believe this gem is only $15. Yeah, for sure. That $60 price tag on most games, most big games, it's purely for business purposes. Ooh, damn. This is going to be a lot of damage. <gasps> Woo! Nice. Good stuff. Good stuff. <laughs> okay, I'm going into the wall. No, oh, nice low. Nice low. $60 is an arbitrary number. Yeah, the price tag of a game doesn't doesn't is not going to equate to the quality of the experience because it's a completely subjective thing. All right, we're going back to King. Really impressed by your dark uppers? Thanks. It's the best it's the best uh, whiff punisher he has. So I really try to use use it as in uh, situations where I can both fast and long and so long range and leads to such good damage, especially considering Armor King has above da above average uh, combo damage. I'm not even close to getting that good at it. Mm. I feel you. I used to be in the. I used to be the same. With practice, 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 like you said. Ooh, that's a clean customization. Good at it yet. Mm.
Nope, that's not that minus. <laughs> Hello, not Pichu. How you doing? Yeah, if you hold back there, my 4 to 1 is guaranteed. He's got w dose 1 for COVID. Hey, that's great. That's great. How does it feel? Good pay. Oh! Okay, okay, nice. Speaking of clean looks, that king looks nice. Hey, thanks. Gameplay was even better. <laughs> Thank you. Um, yeah, I tried to emulate the um, Tekken 5 Dark Resurrection King costume. Uh, where he has white pants, black shoes, and then a blue and white um, jacket to emulate to, which is also an um, a version of uh, King's Tekken 2 costume with a blue shirt, red tie, and uh, white pants. He keeps that color scheme a lot. The blue, the blues, and whites. Classic. Doesn't hurt it at the moment, but people say it's the day after, so I don't know. Uh, maybe it was the same for me. First day wasn't so bad. Second day was a little was was it it was aching in my arm a little bit, uh, but I and I got Pfizer by the way. Your gameplay is great too. And great mix-ups, and with a good throw game. Doesn't look the cleanest, but I think this is my favorite because I didn't steal it. Well, I did stole the idea from my country's flag. Ah, I see. So, hmm. Does that mean... Well, Estonia, so... Yeah, blue, blue and white looks great, you know? And there's black in there too. Estonia has black, blue, and white. I kind of forgot about that. Oh, good. Oh. Good parry. No, oh, nice low. Good duck. Bop, bop. Oh, not quite. Didn't quite get it. It doesn't do that much damage when it's in that state. Huh.
that's going to be a lot of damage. King sometimes, man. Right, I'm going to hop back to Armor King for a couple of matches. the thing. Now, where is Estonia? Oh, there it is. Right under Finland. Completely forgot. I was thinking about where Estonia was located on the map. <laughs> Sorry, I'm getting, I'm getting, a, I'm having a lot of sin. I'm committing a lot of sins with my geography knowledge today. <laughs> and we want to be Nordic and all. Ah. Hey, why not? Alright, red red and blue. <laughs> ah, bop, bop. That's a lot of juicy Oh Good duck. Ooh, I was too late. Good duck. Uh oh. Ooh, what happened there? Nice. Good low defense. This is maximize damage. Damn. Ooh! You can interrupt that in mid string. Okay. Oh wow. That was tight. That was tight. Good launch. Bah. 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 Oof, oh my god. Good break. Ooh, what a hop kick. I'm dead. No! Ooh, launch punish. Not gonna kill, but it's gonna be a lot of damage. <sighs> oh my god, okay. Good dark upper. Ba ba.
No! Nice stuff. Nice stuff. Void? I am the Void. Welcome. How you doing? Welcome to the stream. Ooh. Went right under my magic four. Nope. You might live if you tech. You did. <sighs> Damn, that was tight. You win. <sighs> that was so close. Ah, uh, another person? For the lobby? No, I don't mind. Best Brian player you know? That's cool. Alright. Yeah, go ahead and... The bane of my armor king existence. Okay, okay. Um, yeah, go ahead and add me on Steam. I suppose. If you can find me. And I'll add you to the lobby. Guess we'll go a few more matches. That's fine. <laughs> hey, that's completely up to you if you want to follow or anything like that. It's completely up to you. Oh, there we go. I gotcha. And... Uh, void, void, void. Are you there? Uh, are we playing the game right now, or...? <laughs> no, don't worry about it. Ah, here, there, there you are. There you are. I'm gonna send you an invite in the meantime. Alright, let's play a match while we wait for a boy to get in. Forgot Realm again! <laughs> Must be my lucky day. Or a good day for any King or Armor King player. Brian is cool as hell. I've, dab I've dabbled in Brian a little bit. Uh, just playing around with him a bit and he's... I really like how I really like his long-range uh, counter-hit stuff he can get. It's a cool-ass character. Our resident crazy Marduk is also searching for games. Should I tell him of this channel? Uh, sure, sure. Um, I think we'll do like just a few more matches um, on my end. So, because um, I gotta, because I gotta eat and stuff. But yeah, for sure. I'm gonna play. I'm gonna stream more Tekken in the future. So. Other time, yeah. But I'm I'm all for it. I'm all for it. And maybe we can all have a lobby again sometime again soon. Round two. Fight. Whoa. Okay. Good launch. That's awfully gener that's awfully nice too. Nice. Round three. Fight. No, I did it too early.
No. Wow. Okay. I love playing against Marduk. Like, or grapplers in general. The King, Armor King, Marduk trio is always a fun time for me. Ah! There we go. <laughs> No! No, oh, damn it. Should have just stood up and taken the plus one. Should have just stood up and taken the plus one. But for sure, let's uh, have a let's have uh, let's make a lobby again another time. That would be great. Fitting profile picture for Void. So much positive energy today. It's great. Get ready for the next battle, battle, battle. Mm, that's a lot of matches. Shadow Step 1 feels so underrated. I mean, then again, you have to go into a... Ooh, nice. Good combo. Then again, you have to commit to getting into the stance to get that. And you'll... Given you have to commit to a stance to get plus 1, it's... it's it doesn't sound like the best trade-off, but on counter hit, it does lead to a full combo, so... And it's... Pretty fast. It's pretty fast, so it's not all bad. Ooh. I wonder why that didn't hit. The back one two punish. Well I think it I think he I think Brian did a two four or something, or one four. It's supposed to be a punish, but it's supposed to be a punish, but it didn't hit for some reason. Good tombstone. Ooh, nice. Bring it back. Nice back one. What a low parry. Oh, he probably didn't expect that. Or they. They probably didn't expect that. Ooh. Can't get him all the time. Punish. There you go. Oh, wow. I don't know if that's death, but oh, it is. Wow, good stuff. <laughs> you win. Bop, bop. 
Gotta let it play out. Can't beat him. Let's see if I can beat him. Best Brian I know. Hmm. I love fighting against Brian. Well, yeah, it's the best Brian you know. That's that's what it is. Now let's give it a try. Get ready for the next battle. 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 Let the intros rock. Round one. Fight. I do have a lot of Brian matchup experience. Good block. Good duck. Goal, 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 goal. Good duck. He's got that matchup knowledge. He sidestep that? Huh. Good tech. Nice. Round three. Fight. Good duck. Break. What a sidestep. AK has DLC powers, you can't lose. Sir Pros Pal, hello. Welcome to the stream. Ow. It hurts! Oh, wow, okay, nice. You lose. <laughs> but Brian surpasses the DLC powers for now. Has three times, or two times so far. I didn't dare you to name Law again. Law has three bar pain, so that's enough for him. <laughs> Are you... Is this the... are you the uh, Marduk player we've heard so much about? Okay, cool. Possibly. If Strash said it, yes. Yes, they did. I am the Void. Just cleaned my room and got allergic reaction from the dust. Oh, damn. Oof. I was hoping to get good pointers from you, streamer, but you but you suck as much worse as me. <laughs> well, for now.
That was only a first game. Jeez, if you if you're getting allergic reactions, maybe you take a break or something. Don't want to overexert yourself. I'm also the worst Brian players. I'm also the worst Brian players. Strash knows. <laughs> Ooh, nice clean green color this time. I'm a big. I'm a big fan of uh, green um, or just color edits, like re default costumes, but color edits. I'm a big fan of that. But hey, Sir Pros pal, um, if you want to do a couple matches, you can. Uh, if you'd want to do a couple matches in this lobby, you can uh, add me on Steam and join the lobby. But I'm not gonna be on for long because I gotta because I gotta make dinner soon. But you can hop in and, and do a couple matches if you want. Might as well give it a try. All right. Cool, cool, cool. Ah, oh, there you go. Gotcha. There we go. I'll I'll add you to the I'll send you an invite right after this match. Whoa. <gasps> Ooh, it happens again! This is definitely gonna kill. No, pixel health, there you go. We'll... There you go, there you go. Good stuff. So how's everyone doing? Hope y'all are having a good Wednesday. Currently 6.51 p.m. for me in Sweden. Been at it for two and a half hours. Brian's Rage Art scales weirdly. It always does a lot of damage. I wouldn't be surprised. Alright, cool. GG's. Just send you this invite here. Uh, there we go. Unless it's like the end of a long combo. Yeah, as it is for everyone. I don't know, man. There are different damage values per Rage Art. I believe. I believe that's still the case. Because, you know, Miguel's... I mean, I think they already... I think they patched that out. But Miguel's Rage Art, you know, used to do more damage than average. I don't know if that is still the case, if they've made all Rage Arts do equal amounts of damage, or if they're still different. Maybe they are still different and Brian still just deals more damage, on average. Lucky Chloe's Rage Art does more damage if you press certain bun buttons at certain times. Is that true? But it's usually the same for every character. Hell of a lobby. Three Estonians, one Swede. <laughs> ah, so our, our... That's cool. Oh, that's a nice minty customization. Good break. Nope. That's a 1 plus 2 extension, I think. Good. Should have just done the down two, the four three. Ooh, 
nice, nice. Miguel's Rager seems to do barely anything in terms of damage. Okay. It used to do hella damage in that case then. Like in Season 1, you know? But I don't know if that was maybe a glitch or something. <laughs> Stacked lobby full of grapplers. Oh no! Oh my god, it hit. Well, except for Brian, of course. <laughs> except for Brian. I was thinking about... Um, was thinking about... Um, Ad Black from earlier. <laughs>, Laughs and taunts. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Alright, let's give it a try with King this time. Welp. Snake Edge is the ultimate grapple move, yeah. Now, lows and throws are like... ...fundamentally connected in some form, I guess. Because <laughs> you're giving the opponent some, that little bit extra to think about. Can't just be standing. Can't just be standing up all the time. And defending. I don't think he has that much experience versus kings. Alright. I will see. Round one. Nice customization. Fight. That hurts. Bop, bop, bop. Ow, good launch. I'm dead, I'm super dead. No, never mind. Oh, there we go, there we go. Quick move. Good choice. Stuck. Round four. Fight. I could have probably caught him anyway, but Bop, bop, bop. Nice. You lose. 
GG's. Very good, Ryan. Indeed. See where this takes us, and it is Marduk. Marduk and Brian. A hulking mountain of a man and a cyborg. Well, android, not a cyborg anymore. Not since Tekken 4. At least. Get your cameras ready. Round one. <laughs> Fight. Man, such clean customizations today from e all across the board from everyone. Good break. Bop, bop. Break again. Good stuff. <gasps> Ow, that hurts. Ooh. Weird wall tech. Oh, okay. Gengar vibes with this uh, customization, with this color customization. Bop. Oh, nice. Good conversion. Oh. Ooh, what a knee. <gasps> Ooh, whoa, 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 whoa. That was a good duck. Ooh, soccer kick. Yeah, Gengar, a Pokemon. A, a psychic slash dark type Pokemon? Or something? Or no, he's a ghost type, of course. Uh, he's... Who's all purple and stuff. My favorite Pokemon was Agumon. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Bit of a wrong universe, but, you know. I watched Digimon a lot as a kid. Did surprisingly. Oh, good launch. Bop, bop. Bop, bop. Ooh, gets the grab this time. So much damage. What'll it be? Alright. Get off me. Ooh! Ooh! Wow, that was sick! Just right at the perfect distance to get it in. And then, whoppa! That was a very good whiff punish. Well, good stuff to... good stuff, uh, pros pal. Good launches you got in there, and really good damage. Thought I already had three wins. Yeah, not yet. You're gonna. You're up to break that. You're up here. You're up now to break that streak. 
last one, then I'll watch stream and uh, calm the allergy down. Yeah, for sure. Um, take care of yourself. His defense is always too high. Hmm. I know that feeling. Take care of yourself, Voida. Don't... Don't push yourself if you're having allergic reactions. Be sure to open a window and get an hydrate. I don't mind defense. Him being offensive is a problematic part. Ah. Nice. Purple. Black and white. Fitting color for a purple stage. Just parry. Almost got. Ooh, damn, nice. Caught him. Good launch over to the wall. Not quite. Oh shit. <gasps> Shoulder. Mm. I was thinking the exact same. Ooh, wow. That's not gonna be death, but yeah, nice. Damn. Let's go, Strash. Now it comes up. Ooh, misses. Ooh, <laughs> nah, get back in there. Balcony break. <gasps> Ooh! Doesn't quite punish, but it gets it anyway. Nice stuff. What's the Oki? <gasps> Ooh! Ow! Wow, 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 wow. That was weird. <laughs> ah, you got this. You can break you can break the streak. Oh what a orbital. So good. Good block! Fuck. What a conversion. Damn, that was really good. Oh, wow. That was a good match. <laughs> GG's Void. Well played. Very well played. Now go... Go be safe. Go care for your... If, uh, go care for the... For the allergies. Now, alright? Just stole defeat from the jaws of victory. Yeah, almost got it. But hey. So we're here to practice. Good stuff to both of you. Really good stuff.
It's not like Void is gonna lose. Ah, okay, okay. I gotcha. Oh yeah. Oh, the hood is off. We'll get him. We'll get him next time. We'll get him next time. Don't worry. Oh, wow, wow. Whoa! Guess wrong. So much damage. Good stuff. Matchup knowledge and being as safe as possible. Simple. <laughs> Ow. Ooh, there we go. Nice. We'll get him next time. Strash. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Whoa. Okay, good slide. Oh, damn, okay. Final round. Fight. Ooh, wow, okay. Damn. That low was so critical. N no! Wow, nice. Good stuff. My PC is almost done as well. Getting a monitor next week and GPU next month, so I won't be playing Tekken as often. Alright, alright. But it's fun to meme that Void is becoming unbeatable. <laughs> yeah, I used to have that with my sparring partner. She mains Nina. And we've been sparring, we've been practice partners and sparring partners for since Tekken, the Tekken 6 days. Um, and at some periods, she was she just seemed unbeatable, but eventually I got the upper hand, and then we're sort of going back and forth, you know, sort of pushing each other to do better each time. I also I, I wasn't sure if the rage was gonna. I, I thought it was I w I thought it was gonna do pick it's gonna go down to pixel health, and that's what it did. But it was really close. So what you're telling me is you'll get a better monitor anyway. It'll be easier to break throws. <laughs> yeah, for sure. I'm stuck at purple. Also, every giant swing I kept missing one and doing three instead of two. Ah, okay. I gotcha. Hello, Dark Acme. Welcome back. How's it going? Round one. We're just going to play a couple more matches now. For real this time. Uh, okay. Ah, here we go. Where's the Nina play- where- where's the Nina player these days? Can't be doing any worse than being with three Estonians. Just playing sessions online? Alright, cool. Cool, cool. Um, my sparring partner, she plays 
mostly on she plays entirely on uh, PlayStation. So that's partially why I keep my PlayStation Plus going. So I'll be playing casually if I play Tekken and try out other characters too. All right, cool. Well, it's it's really good games, Void. It's it's um, hope we can get some more lobby matches again another day. Either on stream or just casually on another day. Either way, GG's. Well played. I'll switch to PC soon. Alright. I really enjoy that you... I really like that you don't have to pay for, to play online on PC. So that's... That's part... That's part partly a reason to that I play on PC but also because of better input better input uh, latency um, or response time and better net code on PC for Tekken 7 so Round four. Fight. there will be more matches just need to explore other games uh, one the games once I get a better rig yeah I got I got gotcha. you for sure. Getting new PC parts is empower it feels empowering. Can I join in too? Um Sure. Sure. Uh not not that I don't want you to join, but I'm not I'm just gonna be on for another two matches or so. But I'll send you an invite I'll throw you an invite. And uh I'll throw you an invite and uh, you can play a match or two. We're not friends, though, I believe. Ah, okay, okay. Um, but yeah, actually... Um, I'm gonna play this one, and then one more, and then I'm gonna leave. So, maybe maybe next time. Sorry. Next time, though, for sure. I'm hungry. I gotta eat dinner. I gotta cook dinner, and then I get it, and then I'm gonna eat it. So, I imagine now though. Yeah, that's great. That's great. Ooh, Negan. Been playing only Tekken for like two years now. It's getting a bit boring for me. Okay. Yeah. I play a lot of games. I can't. I can't. I can't. Uh, oh yeah, here we go. I can't bring myself. I can't bring myself to um, just play one game for an extended period of time. I go. I go in like phases between what games I play. I never play just one game. Um, but it's. Uh, it's. I go in between a various different games in phases. Oh shit! Nice launch. That's what I do. It's good range on that. Also, I'm a game designer and a concept artist, so I have to play different games. And I couldn't bear, I couldn't bear playing games if I didn't get some variety, you know. Good block. Oh, nice. Let's go, I'm gonna... I'll get back to you in a sec, chat. Just in a sec. Talk about the Tekken 8 leak. Mm. Yeah. I mean, of course it's gonna happen, but. I would rather have uh, gotten an of, like a, their official confirmation and not gotten the leak tell me it was coming, but, you know. 
I'm still gonna love my love the time when I. No, I ducked. Still gonna love my time watching what they do reveal it though, probably. But anyway, I'm I'm excited. I'm so like this was this has been the best Tekken game they've made since Tekken Five in my opinion. So I'm hoping they do good, make good on this, and keep doing good stuff. No, I'm dead. Who honestly cares about the leak? Yeah, Tekken 8 confirmed, but woohoo, but it was kind of confirmed when it was all just old millions. Yeah, that's pretty much it. That's pretty much it. Alright, this is going to be my last match, and then I'm going to leave. People were excited about Season 5. Yeah, I'm personal I personally think that Tekken 7 is done. It doesn't need anything more. I mean, I felt that for a while, but, you know. I would love something, I would love for them to move on to a new game, then to keep, then to... Like, this game has been, Tekken 7 has been supported for so long to begin with. And that's great. They've done so much for the game to make help it grow, and that's what's made it see so much success. Not a thing has been said officially. Yeah, I know, but... We need Tekken 8, no more, op no more OP characters. Yeah, I mean, Season 3 is what brought uh, Fakumram and Leroy, and that was ridiculous. But Season 4 has seen very good char like, very good balancing among its characters. You know, with Lydia and uh, Kunimitsu. That's all been, like, they've been w very well-tuned, in my opinion. And they are well-tuned, in my opinion. Hell, I'm not even sure if uh, Lydia even deserved the nerf from, uh, from uh, the latest patch. Damn it. Good. Good mid. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> oh, nice. That was like a good time for me to throw that out. No! Into the wall. GG's. GG's. Good games all around. What do we got? I hope Fock will be in Tekken 8, but it's not but not like his this OP version. Bruce would be sick too. Agreed? Careful what you wish for. There's still room for five more characters in the character select screen. Yeah, there's just because it ergonomic. Uh, 
Just because it fits doesn't mean that it'll happen. <laughs> no 2D characters, two bears, no William sisters, and absolutely no Katarina, please. <laughs> Negan, Marduk, Eliza, and Goose. Man, yeah, so many, so many various opinions about what Tekken 8 should have. 2D, no 2D, no more bears. Hell, I... Maybe tone down the 2D elements a little bit, but... I don't know if there are gonna be, if the, those guest characters are gonna be in it. I don't know if they're gonna keep pushing for guest characters, but... If, any, if there's any opinion I would have about Tekken 8 in hopes, it would probably be to maybe not, not have as many characters. Because it can, it can get a little bloated at times. The metagame and the, the matchup checks, pretty much. But that's just me, though. Either way, I still love playing the game. So I don't, I don't have much to say other than that, really. I just want the original Tekken cast back. Yeah, I really want the originals, obviously. Like, as long as King is in it, which he's always going to be in it, I'm fine. But I can definitely see why it was polarizing for some people to not play Tekken 7 when they're, when other popular characters, like, you know, like Armor King, uh, wasn't in the base roster. That's because they wanted to make King have Armor King, because they put Armor King moves in, in King and put Marduk moves in Gigas that they were like, ah, just play King or... Gigas if you want to play Armor King or Marduk, you know, but it's not, it doesn't, it doesn't work really the same way, but. And Lei is an interest, is interesting case because he wasn't that widely used in Tekken, in Tekken Tag 2, so it made sense to me why he wasn't in the base game, but he is such a classic character, so, like, he would, he got in in Tekken 2, so it's a little weird for me, like, even though he's not popular, because considering bears are never widely used as either, like, maybe keep, like, maybe have a wider array of, like, the classic characters, but that's about it. So now probably they'll evict Anna? Maybe. Anything can happen, really. I like Nina more than Anna, personally, as well. Remove Jack again. <laughs> That'd be funny. Um, but anyway, uh, without further ado, I can talk about this stuff for hours. And it's all great stuff. But yeah, thank you all very much for watching. Thank you for, for all the great games. Thank you all very much for the follows. It's been great to have you. Really fun to play and really good games. So take care, everyone. Uh, we'll be sure, and to not peach you, we'll be sure to have a session again uh, soon. And um, hope to see you again in, an, in another lobby to the rest of you. And thank you very much for the follow, I Am The Void. Ah, I can see my webcam is covering. There we go. Anyway, so be safe. Have a good week. Have a good Wednesday. Have a good meal. All that jazz. And I'll catch you all in the next one, all right? GG's. See you later.